The foundation of any plan within Right Capital starts with the initial data entry process. After creating a new client plan, the first step of this process will be the family profile. This is where we can specify the members of our client household, in addition to a number of important details for each individual within our plan. If you've imported this household using one of Right Capital's CRM integrations, like Redtail or Wealthbox, please note that client details and additional household members may already be here upon first opening the client plan. These integrations can be helpful time savers during the data entry process, but it is generally recommended to give the family profile a thorough once over before progressing to the next step. For today, we'll be filling out our family profile manually, starting with our client card. Click on the card to open a drawer on the right side of your screen where you can enter more information. If it's not already here, specify the first and last name of the client. If you'd like, you can also enter a middle name, title, or suffix. Next, we'll enter the client's birthday. This is an important input that will be used to establish both a client's current age as well as their full retirement age. You can click on the calendar to select a year, month, and day, or simply click on the text box and manually type in a date. Next, we have the client's planning horizon, the age at which the client is assumed to pass away. This age will be used as the final year of this client's life in Right Capital's Monte Carlo analysis and future cash flow projections. There is one additional input that you'll find here in the client card, which is the resident state. The state that you select here will determine the state tax laws and calculations within the plan, making this an important variable for both the retirement analysis as well as the estate analysis. The resident state is only entered here within the client card and will be used as the state of residence for the entire household. Once the inputs within the client card are fully entered, we can click Save and then move on to the co-client card. This is where we'll enter the full name, birthday, and planning horizon for the co-client within our household. Every client plan will generate a co-client card as a starting point, but if you're planning for a single individual, you can always remove the co-client by clicking the X icon in the upper right and then clicking Delete. Additional family members, such as children or grandchildren, can be added to the household by clicking the Add Participant button in the upper right. This will add an additional data card, allowing you to enter the details for that family member. Although Right Capital is focused primarily on planning for the client and the co-client, adding children and grandchildren allows them to be tied to specific goals, assigned as the beneficiaries for specific accounts, and marked as the insured individual on insurance policies. Adding children in particular will automatically generate a college goal for that child within the goal section of the client profile. Adding a child will also cause Right Capital to automatically calculate certain tax credits, like child and education credits, when applicable. Once we've entered all of the members of our client household, click the Next button in the lower right to progress to the next step of the initial data entry process. One last thing to note here. After you've completed the onboarding template for a client and unlocked the rest of their Right Capital plan, the family profile can be accessed going forward within the Profile Family tab. You can add new family members and make changes to the information here at any point in the future. As always, if you have any questions while filling out the family profile, the Right Capital support team is available to help. You can use the live chat feature in the lower right corner of your screen, or you can give our team a call at 888-982. 9596, option 2. For tutorials like this one focused on other steps of the data entry process, you can visit the training videos section of the Right Capital Help Center.